hello viewers this is Acholrafi once again welcome to this new video where i'm going to show you how to send your very first email campaign using mailchimp you will learn how to design an email newsletter template and add other information on the way to send out your very first email campaign in our previous videos we have learned basic about email marketing and the process to set up an account on mailchimp to learn more from these videos please check out the link in description to learn the full process of setting up an email campaign, let's click on campaigns button. In this page, we will see all the campaigns listed that we are going to send out in future. To start designing our email template and to send out our campaign, we have to click on create campaign button. In this page, we have options to create email, landing page, sign up forms and other features. But as we are about to send an email campaign, we have to click on email. Now we have options to choose from regular, automated, plain text or AB text emails. But we are going to move forward with regular email and we'll learn about the other features on our future videos step by step. It's time to put our campaign name. I am putting email marketing tutorial and hitting on begin button. Time to select the recipients list. Click on add recipients, then select the list. Here we have options to send emails on segment or tag basis. Bit advanced, but we'll learn using these features in future videos. Check personalize the two fields so that your email recipients will receive a personalized email mentioned his or her name in the beginning of the email. Select the F name to mention their first name on the email. Click on save. If we need to make any change on from field, we have the options to. Click on the edit from, we will have options to change email and name. After making necessary change, click on save. Now we have got one of the most important parts of an email campaign to set up. Put a short, spam free and attractive subject line so that your email will place on inbox field of an email and the recipient will open it up, which will increase the chance of getting more success. I am adding a short preview text which will also be helpful to give some idea about the email to the recipient. Then clicking on save. So we did all other setups and it's time to move for email newsletter design. Click on design email. In this page, we have got many pre-built email layouts to start working on. In Themes tab, we have got many free to use beautiful templates. Please don't forget to check them out when you design your email newsletter. Moving to layouts page. These are the mostly used layouts that thousands of people are using. I'm going to show you how to design a newsletter by using the one into two column layout. So clicking on it. So here we are on the email newsletter design dashboard where we'll be able to add our email content such as a logo or header, email content and a image with tags and other options as we need. Now I'm going to add a header image which I have designed on Canva to use in this email. So click on replace, then click on upload. And then select the image, click on open and it's being uploaded. Uh, click to select and then click on insert. Alright, so here the image has been uploaded and it's time to make a change here on the content section. So I'm just going to click and here we go. We have got the option to make changes so i'm going to make changes here in fast forwarding mode you will be able to use other formattings as you need from the options
now i am going to add text into this text field and i will assign clickable links to fiber upwork and freelancer.com to give a linking select the targeted text and click on the linking icon put the targeted web address make sure the open in new window option is checked then click on insert i'm going to do the same for upwork and freelancer.com Now all of these marketplaces names are clickable and if our email recipients click on them websites will be loaded on new tabs. Time to add an image here in this column. Clicking on browse, upload, select the image, open and again we have to select it from here, insert. So photo has been uploaded and it's time to make change on the text. So I'm going to click and we have got the options or feature to change the text. So I'm going to make some change. Example text has been added and now I want to add a button under it. We have got options to add different elements from this page. Click on button and drag it through the place where you want it to see. Here we will be able to make necessary changes. I am changing the button text, color, button white and other elements. You will find all the options. Please take times and customize yours as you need. Our template is looking much better for now. Time to add social icons and links. Click on the tab and you will find all the fields. I am adding my Twitter, Facebook, website, Instagram profile link. You will be able to add more when you need. After adding all wanted elements, click on save and close. I always keep this part untouched as they collect all important information from the registration process, which complies with CanSpam Act of Email Marketing. Our template is ready to preview. Click on preview and test button, click on enter preview mode and we will be able to see how is our email template going to look on desktop devices and on mobile devices. As we keep the last portion untouched, please take a look, it already got our address and added other options along with unsubscribe button. We have got the social icons clickable but I almost forget to add links in images. Let's do this right now. Click on the image, then click on link button and put the targeted web address. I am putting the email marketing tutorial series playlist. Make sure the open in new window is checked and click on insert. Now if our email recipients click on the image, they will be redirected to our email marketing tutorial series in a new tab. I am doing the same for this image too. We should have this button clickable as well with the targeted web address. Let's put the link. Now click on save and close. Review the links by clicking preview and test. Click on open link checker. See if all links are indicating the link parts of the template. If you find all good, click on cross mark so that our template is ready. But before sending the email to all our contacts, we should send a test email to see if all are working fine with it. I am sending a test email to my email. After entering the email, click on send test. You will receive an email within few seconds. Check it on desktop and on mobile to see all functionality is working or not. Just take a look. All is looking pretty well. Now we can click on save and close button to proceed in sending the email campaign. If you want to give a final check, here is the option. 
but without further ado let's click on send button then again click on send now it will take few seconds and here we go high five so email marketing tutorial will go out shortly and this is how it's now in on its way and this is how email campaigns are being sent out through mailchimp so i hope this video was helpful to you and if you have found this video helpful please subscribe this channel like this video to encourage me to make more videos and i hope to see in the next video here here the email has been appeared to learn more about email marketing please don't forget to check out the email marketing tutorial series playlist from my channel thank you very much